My name is John Kenworthy, and I have the pleasure of being your guide through your journey to achieve your success. Everyone I meet, everyone I have worked with, all of us share something in common. That is the desire to achieve success. For most people, success is an elusive and strange thing. Gather five people together and ask them what success is, and you will hear five different answers. There may be quite a lot in common between everyone, but our idea of success is what we want to achieve. Sure, you can borrow somebody else's notion of success as your own, but will it fulfil you? Will it make you happy if you achieve that? This nine-part course is designed to enable you to identify your own success, to identify the obstacles you have faced in the past and those you will probably face in the future, so that you know what is possible for you. Now we have to leave the comfort zone line and change to the get off my butt line. And this is a butt with one T, not two. We'll be examining your strengths and weaknesses, making sure that you plan life balance into your success and set smart goals that will allow you to turn to the future with confidence. At this point, the road ahead can get a little rough. If you've set yourself goals in the past, you already know that this bit is still relatively easy. It's the road ahead that gets rough. The problem for most people is not in setting their goals, it's getting out of their own way. I'll be helping you identify those parts about yourself that are, quite frankly, your own wisdom. There will be resistance. Whenever we attempt to do something that is beyond our comfort zone, we will resist. We need to know how to have a mindset that supports our growth. To deliberately choose to be at cause for ourselves and our success, and keep ourselves motivated in going forward, even when we really, really don't want to, or worse, we don't. To ensure that you are pulled along by your vision and purpose, we'll move to the action zone at this point, keeping you lined up to your real purpose. I'll share with you an incredibly powerful tool that will take your goals and plant them firmly in your unconscious mind, so that as you develop the right habits to support your new achievement orientation, it becomes almost now, there may still be times when you procrastinate, and that's okay. Procrastination is a red flag moment. I'll teach you how to use it to defeat yourself. Then, in part eight of the course, we'll make it happen. You'll have a clear plan, a way to manage your time and efforts effectively. The final station on our journey is, well, it's a never-ending journey. You will put in place the unconscious triggers that will create your new habitual achievement orientation, regularly reviewing where you are on the journey to your success and making the adjustments that are appropriate for you. Oh, and yes, you can change your goals. Of course you can. This is a constantly moving feast. You don't have to wait for a new year or even a new year. But what you will find is that once you have identified your own real purpose in life, your goals and what you do every day will be things that support your goals. So that's your journey ahead. I cannot promise that it is always going to be an easy ride. In fact, if it's too easy, trust me, those goals are not very satisfying. I'm thrilled that you have chosen to come on this journey with me. Remember, I'm here to guide you and support you. If you ever need my help, I'm just in the middle of